Hello friends, welcome to a new happy learning video. We already know that jobs are divided into three sectors. Primary or production sector, secondary or manufacturing sector, and the tertiary or service sector. Today, we're going to get to know a little more the first one of them. Today, we're going to work in the primary sector. Primary sector jobs are those that obtain primary sources directly from nature. Farming, agriculture, forestry, fishing and mining. Let's get to know a little more about each one of these occupations. Farming consists of breeding livestock, animals, and a livestock farmer is a person who does this job. There are two types of farming, intensive and extensive farming. In intensive farming, animals live in farms and stables, with a farmer in charge of feeding and looking after them. In extensive farming, animals live in natural open air terrains and this is where the farmer goes to take care and protect them. There are four types of livestock. Sheep farming, like these sheep. Cattle farming, like these cows. Pig farming, like these pigs. Or poultry farming, like these hens. Agriculture consists of the cultivation of land to obtain vegetable products and a crop farmer is a person who has this occupation. The first thing a crop farmer does is plough the land by moving it around. Then seeds are planted and after the necessary time the fruits are harvested, which means collected, once they have ripened. There are two types of cropping dry farming and irrigation farming. Dry farming grows only with rainwater, like wheat or almonds. Irrigation farming is watered artificially because crops need more water than dry farming, like tomatoes or rice. Forestry consists of the cultivation, care and exploitation of woodland and hills. Thanks to forestry, products such as wood or firewood are collected, but it also helps to investigate on how to protect nature, something completely fundamental for all living things in order for the whole planet to have a good environmental quality. Fishing consists of the catching of fish and other aquatic animals in rivers, lakes and at sea. Fishing that takes place in rivers is called river fishing. And if it's at sea, we call it sea fishing. Sea fishing has two types, deep sea fishing and shallow sea fishing. Deep sea fishing is done by great big boats far away from the coast. With refrigerated chambers, since they spend a lot of time at sea, they need to freeze their prey so they don't go bad. Shallow sea fishing is done by smaller boats that come to the coast. They usually live every day that the weather enables them to. Within fishing and during the last decades, aquaculture has emerged which consists of the production of algae and aquatic animals in tanks called fish farms. It's like agriculture and farming, but underwater. Mm. 
Mining consists on the collection of mineral resources from the floor and subfloor, and the miners are those who perform this job. There is a great variety of minerals. There are metallic minerals, like iron or gold, non-metallic minerals, like marble or granite, and energetic or combustible minerals, like oil, gas or coal. These last ones are the most important ones, but also the ones that contaminate the most. Now we've got to know the primary sector. Now's the time to reflect. Imagine there was an over-exploitation of fishing and the seas and rivers are left with no fish. In some places, this is already happening. Imagine for a moment that we cut down all trees in our country and with them many animals that depend on them. This is also happening in many countries. It's fundamental that everyone that works in the primary sector respects nature so its primary sources aren't depleted and their work is sustainable. But we all also need to take care and defend nature. Only this way we will achieve a better world. <laughs>